So you need the test, you need to hold it this way to do the test. Okay, so let's try this again. Oh, oh. I come I never seen this. Oh testy. Oh Balance test result. Excellent, excellent, excellent. You Look at this. Something. So we want the screen facing me, and we want to have this guy in here. So a latch on a latch. Hmm. That's good. it up and let's see what this does. Uh, let's get this one open. Oh, I love it. Mm, I like it. I might post it later on. Okay. Okay, I guess that's the way in. But it's... Let's go backwards. It makes. Uh, we'll see. Let's see if that does the work. We have it in place on this side. It is there, but I'm wondering how about when it's time to. Well, it's looking like it. Do not. Uh, use the DJI app, the one that uh, it's, you probably already have if you had that drone. Of course, the gimbal is also there, but that's not a new um, app. It has a standalone app. You want to have, for the RS2, you want to have this open while you turn the power on. Power on is on the side. So let's get that one. Turn power on. Let us uh, go over to the balancing. Uh, first, we start with the tilt, upwards tilt. All right, so now let's look at, there's a, there's a knob here. I'm going to let that open. We need to, oh, it's pretty solid. Oh, so that's, that's what we need to get. Alright. It is looking like it is in place, but how can that be for the first time? We need an offset for this. So to fix this, we go step backward. You need from uh, small rig. And we put that on the black magic. Let's do that. That's it. This will work. Look. All right, we have space here. We can now proceed with the balancing. Um, now we go over here and uh, unlock once again. All right, so now almost. So I'm gonna unscrew this one. Let's see what it does. What does it do? 
So, so we we'll move forward or backwards. Hmm. So I think this is it. Screw it. It is vertical now. All right. Now we do the straight up, and we know that it is um, back heavy. All right. So we we'll screw forward. We open, and then we we'll screw. So easy. Stay back heavy. Almost there. And we are there. Open this one so we can slide. We'll slide this one. It's falling this way, so we want to slide the other way. Mm. We are there for the first time. I guess my setup is just uh, friendly. But now this US gimbal has to be doing something right. First of all, this one, we need to lock this one back. We are on the pan axis, which is the, the pan axis, which is this. Um, let's figure out where we unlock. All right, here we go. Ready? All right. Why is everything looking like it's on point? Let's look at, it's going to the left. So we're gonna tip, we're tilting, it's going to the left. So if it's going to the left, we move it backwards. So this is already unlocked. We move it backwards and lock it up. Tilt again. Still going to the left. Okay. We don't want it to go to the left, so we'll give it some weight by moving it backwards. Let's see. Little bit. Okay. Looks like we found the spot. It stays here. Stays here. Stays here. I think we're good. So you need the test. You need to hold it this way to do the test. Okay. So let's try this again. Oh, oh, I come on, never seen this. Oh, testy. Oh, balance test result. Excellent, excellent, excellent. You Row pan and tilt. Excellent. All right. So now let's see. You know what? What are the moods we need to learn? Mm. Okay. So let's go to calibrate. So that's the calibration. So that's what I thought the balance test was. Wow, shaking the table. 80%. Gimbal calibration com complete, confirm. Yep. Okay, so now what is the default? We have a new firmware firmware version 1. Point, I guess that's the app firmware I don't know but I'm gonna say update firmware version 1.0.102.0030 available what's new firmware update complete confirm Demo mode, I'm turning it on. Let's see what happens. It's gonna show some of the things it can do. 
360. Mm -hmm. Tilt. Nice. And nice. Here goes the vertex mode. Oh, what do they call it here now? Inverted or oh, I don't know. Wanna go? Impressive, huh? <laughs> it is testing to see that everything works well. What happens if it accidentally breaks? It won't break. All right, just as I thought. All right, let's get the briefcase mode. Let's get this guy on. So you put it on the left or the right, but I think it's going to go on the right for me. But okay, I'm going to use borrow that from my um, two options I think we possibly can do. I'm sure you could use this. It's still a grip. Oh, this. Okay. Got it. Okay. So that's, that goes our briefcase mode. It kind of look close to this. And use this just to be sure. Screen with this knob here. So this will work well too. Um, let's try and see. Ready? Yep, very nice. Feels even more comfortable. As long as it doesn't um, lose on screw. It already has the grip for the finger, so we're good with that. Mm. 